That's a huge fleet. The enemy ships are trying to infest the town with monsters. Well, it's not gonna happen. Time to do some extermination. Is this the second troop of the Earth Invasion forces? Hostiles are raining down. Proceed with caution. Foot soldiers, don't stray too far from the tanks. Enemy ship on the way! They just don't stop coming. The last one. It's done. <laughs> Enemy ship flying in. They activated their teleporter. What is up with these guys? Hey, something bad's going down. Red androids. Relocate immediately. Those androids are bad news. Fall back. Team Delta is to the left. Link up with them. Forget the tanks! Go! Group up with Delta. Keep moving. We're tailing up. We don't have the numbers for this. Keep them at bay, but stay on the move. Avoid fighting in small numbers. Regroup first, and then fight back. They're making a beeline for us. Our attacks aren't doing jack! Their shells are incredible! Our bullets are just bouncing off! These guys aren't just harder now. They're better in every way. Faster and stronger. Not to mention, they get mad! Don't stop to try and fight them properly! It's too risky! Delta's right there! Chop, chop! Group up with Delta! Getting used to pulling the trigger? This way! Get a move on! <laughs> what a terrifying enemy! But we're going to survive! Just you wait! Charlie is straight ahead. Let's help them out. Let's go! Enemy ships! The enemy ship is producing androids! Red androids close again! Divided, you're going to get picked off one by one. Group up, then fend them off together with Charlie. Charlie's just ahead. It's not safe, but I'm heading over. Dead ahead! Let's go! On the move! Waking up the Charlie! We'll bring up the rear! Rendezvous with Charlie! These guys are tough as nails! Not much we can do by ourselves! We're in over our heads! Grouping up with Charlie! This is a model with high specs whose capabilities have all been enhanced. They were likely specialized for combat with infantry in urban locales. Take them on once you've grouped up. Fall back to Charlie's position. Shoot! Too far! 
The powered exoskeleton Irene. It's raring to go. Did you lose them? Good. Link up with Charlie. This way! Get a move on! Crack down on illegal immigrants. That is where we make our stand. We make our defenses impenetrable and we make it out alive. Are we clear? Grouping up with Charlie. We're going home alive. This one's called the Aaron. It's our latest and fully equipped for war. Tell me. Enemy ship passing through. Androids coming in hot. Enemies incoming. Don't leave your powered exoskeleton. We need to hold the line and keep them away. They're flanking. Keep your heads on a swivel. Don't let those red androids get any closer! They're no threat from a distance, so fire away! We can't shoot them yet! What's going on? Keep shooting until they go down! That's all we can do! These shells are meant to resist our weapons. They are likely an improved model created specifically to face foot soldiers in urban landscapes. They adapted to the situation too quickly. Have they planned everything out already? Or are they simply able to produce new weapons at a rate we can only imagine? New ship models are continuing to rain down androids. Their numbers are dramatically exceeding our projections. Their androids are being constantly upgraded. If things go on like this... Those civilians are in danger! Destroy the robots! They're gonna burn us alive! <laughs> it's hot! It's so hot! The soldiers are here! We're saved! They're equipped with flamethrowers! They've been modified to attack humans specifically! Set it 
this guy! The robot was destroyed that easily? Cover them! <laughs> Robots practically skim the ground when they fly. Huh? Their thin brains allow them to fit in a tight space so they can hunt down and kill people. It's even more efficient at killing people than the drones. What a horrific weapon! This is how they optimize for efficiency. Let's go get right there, God. Clearly, they're not the type to stop and smell the roses. What squares? There are more robots than we estimated. We need reinforcements. There's a team nearby. Hold out until they arrive. Wing divers are in combat. Provide backup. Roger that. Help me! Entering the rain. The round armor completely covers the robot. It has no weak points like tires or sensors, and even its weaponry is defended. The smooth, rounded armor around this weapon is perfect for deflecting gunfire. Put simply, we believe it was developed to combat infantry. In order to attack, the armor must open up for a moment. It's risky. But we can destroy it by shooting inside this opening. Weather attacks, the armor opens up. We can take them down by shooting them there. Yes, sir. I'll make you a side chair. Robots are beginning to gather. I can't handle this on my own. Help! Let's try it. robots at the city center. It's a machine for killing humans. It's even more of a threat than the drones. We will call these robots excavators. The excavator attack destroyed Land 7. What? That's an underground facility. It appears they have breached the inner area of Land 7. These excavators were likely created to attack underground facilities and bunkers. Unbelievable. They're taking out our safe zones one by one. They were clearly extremely well prepared. It's a large army of enemy robots. If it's a fight they want, they got it. Here come the robots! The enemy's movements suggest that they may have predicted our attack.
Enemy ships stopped over the ocean. What are they doing there? They seem to be releasing something, many of which have already gone into the ocean. What do we do now? specialized in one-on-one -on -one combat. It's a horrific weapon, but you fight back with unpredictable tactics. You're a true soldier. Don't lose focus. If you get hit with that acid, it's bad news. A submarine has disappeared off this coast. There are also missing civilian vessels. You're saying that's related to this monster? Not necessarily, but if you notice anything irregular, report back. We have a good view here. We can take out monsters before they get close. Keep your cool. We proceed with caution. A message from Air Force. Sirens are incoming. They were crossing the ocean, but have changed course. What? We are not prepared to intercept. I advise we let them pass and not attack. Exterminate them. It appears that something is chasing the siren. Chased? Were they not just traveling across the ocean? We do have reports of a battle in the area with marine life. It could be this marine life in pursuit. You're saying there's monsters in the ocean? Is the thing the enemy ship dropped in the ocean a new creature? Flying in low. Do not attack. Look! There's something in the air! It's a siren. The sirens are here. The sirens are flying low. It's a great chance to hit them, but we're not prepared. Do nothing and let them pass. Motion detected, in the ocean. A monster? Unclear. Please stay alert. A fog's forming. The fog is getting thick. We can't see ahead. We can't fight like this. 
Something's coming from the ocean. Back away from the coast. Something moved. The water. There's something in the water. It's huge. Is it a whale? It's walking. I don't think that's a whale. What the hell is that? Hurry up, 1-6. One 1-6 six. One six here. Headed there now. The water's not too cold, is it? There's only fish in the water. Take a look. Hey! Don't get close to the water! Ah, the son of a fisherman. The ocean! That's a merman! Run! Flee to higher ground! One six here. We just arrived. What's the situation? I was supposed to swim with all this fog. Can't see a thing. on land as well. This is a major threat. We can't fight it underwater, though. We need to face it on land. Teleportation anchor has come down! I'm becoming a singer once this morning. Excavators! They're teleporting excavators! Huh, huh. 
Destroy the excavators. They're robots that move on the surface and underground, attacking humans indiscriminately. Destroy them all. with that. life forms known as the Skella has changed the situation drastically. Battles continue to be fought in coastal areas around the world, and the situation is ever-changing. While all areas within 10 kilometers of the coastline have been ordered to evacuate, we expect this to be further extended to 50 kilometers. All those who live in such areas prepare for evacuation at once.
you're always able to survive. And I mean that in a good way. This fog is keeping visibility low. Stay alert. Let's go, and don't hesitate. They're definitely in the city. Stay sharp. There's one! A mermaid! Mermen, fishmen, whatever they are, let's make them regret ever coming ashore. There are dark monsters in this fog. The fair has got to sure. infiltrated this far inland. So they can live on land and in water? That's horrifying. Merman spotted! Excavators! to infect the seas and minimize the area where humans can safely operate. We certainly didn't see this one coming. Our submarine fleets and carriers have played an important role in our operations thus far, but this will limit their usefulness going forward. We believe that these primers from outer space will be unprepared for underwater operations. We underestimated that. Fighting them is pointless. No matter how many we kill, they just keep coming to shore. It's over. We're going to get you.
We'll fight with you. Follow me! Move forward! The war situation is in our favor. Is that so? We are soldiers, brave and strong. Our muscles will protect you all from any harm. Raise up your voices in a battle cry. Form a band, advance on them. We're found. We'll miss the target. Leave it to me. Shoot them dead. Sightings of sea creatures are being reported from all regions. The largest number of reports is from the west coast. The sea creatures may have a base somewhere in the North Pacific. If they're multiplying in the ocean, they could reach unmanageable numbers. Humanity would lose the oceans. Lead. What? 
Looks like we're Coming this way! Now. Shoot! Can we stop shaking? The enemy's Just range. you wait. My safety device disabled. Yes, yes sir. sir! Into the range! Come on! We will call these sea creatures Skilla from now on. The name of a mythical beast, huh? Don't give those things such an exaggerated title. It'll only scare the soldiers. I didn't really think it through. Approach was a success. We're right under them. Why are the evolved ships shaped like that? I can't tell the front from the back. It will definitely come true. They released an anchor. It's an evolved teleportation anchor. The teleporter is activating. The enemies will be sent through. We can't wait for our main forces any longer. Destroy the anchor! It's an evolved anchor. You up for the job? Get close to the anchor space! Attack the tip from directly below it! Eliminate tent monster that stands in your way! <laughs> drop as many as you like! You drop one, we destroy one! Enemy ship dropping another anchor! Another anchor coming down! Damn it! Where's our main force? We can't handle this all by ourselves! Yes, we can! And we must! So long as the teleportation device is intact, this area is basically their territory! Stop it! <laughs> We've got a warning message from the Siren Surveillance Corps. Confirming now. Ship dropped an anchor! The next wave is here! Snap them in half! Huh? There are so many enemy ships, yet they only drop one anchor at a time. How odd. Why are they being so cautious? This is an emergency. The siren is expected to pass through your area. Excuse me? So the enemy is being so passive due to the siren. Enemy ships on the move. They appear to be leaving. We chase them off. The siren has entered the operation area.
ship dropped an anchor. We can't just leave the anchor. But we don't have enough manpower to fight the siren either. Where is the main force? They're here. Good. Engage. Commence attack. The siren is running amok. Our intel didn't say anything about this. It doesn't matter. Just reduce it to ashes. For a recon team, you sure can't fight. You've shown some real guts today. You're all welcome to join my squad any day. Attack the siren! Their ships will be damaged by the Siren's rampage. They'll drop anchors and leave. to chase it. Just let it go. Boop. 
The Siren still had plenty of strength left over. Our forces are no match for it. But even the Siren isn't immortal. What? We have visual confirmation of it sleeping for over 24 hours, usually after it sustains injuries. That means it must sleep to heal its wounds. That's right. A siren sleeps for up to several days. It may not always be a deep slumber, but according to our data, the longest it slept is 46 hours. So our attacks were effective. That gives us a means to fight it. If we time it right, we could attack it while it's sleeping. Approach the siren. Attack team, eliminate the surrounding enemies and ensure the demo team's safety. Look, Skilla! There are Skilla all around! The Skilla are gathering around the siren. They must be here to protect it. Eliminate any nearby enemy. The demolition team will take care of the big one. The siren will not regain consciousness until its wounds are healed. So go ahead, get trigger happy! It seems the siren and Skiller have a symbiotic relationship. Our recent survey suggests the skiller increase in number when the siren sleeps. That would explain it. As it is defenseless while sleeping, the siren probably calls for the skiller. There are similar symbioses within Earth's ecosystem. So it's relying on another life form for protection. Defeated it! Oh my god, Shantra! Reload! Amazing! I got shot! 
Only the Braves can fly. You don't... Let's go! Looks like a friendly fire. Take down the enemies. Unlock weapon system. Everyone stay alert! This yes, sir! escaped. It got away, huh? Do not pursue the siren. The objective now is to eliminate enemies in the area. It escaped this time, but the thing's not invincible. It has to rest to heal its wounds. Now that we know that, we just have to wait for the perfect opportunity. Losing the fight! 
The tanks have arrived. Fall back to their position. Back up. Stop. Back up. Come back. Fall back and draw the enemy within oh. our tank's range. to the infantry. You'd better protect the tanks. of enemies is closing in. Grenadiers! They've got grenades on them! Grenadiers approaching! They're trying to blow up our tanks. Infantry, engage the grenadiers and make sure they don't get close. Keep the grenadiers away. Protect our tanks! They counter us perfectly! They know how to use their weapons! They won't make it easy for us!
operation. I've sent you the files just now. That's outside of your authority. No outside interference is allowed when it comes to the Strategic Intelligence Division. Not only does the enemy know our every strategy, they're working to turn the tables on us. We need to turn them right back around. These are groundless delusions. I know how the enemy will advance. I've entered everything I've been able to remember. Just look at the data I sent you. You seem tired. You need to get some rest. It's hard to believe what I'm seeing in this data, but... You don't need to point it out. Will the enemy really come here? They're flying low and headed toward the metro area. It's amazing that you were able to figure that out. Be quiet. Hey, they really came. Look at the radar. The intelligence division did well. Get ready for an attack. Looks like the intelligence division guessed right. Prepare for battle. Kick out those illegal intruders. Looks like they detected us. Monsters ain't coming! Soldier? I wanna be a hero. The enemy's coming really back! Excited. The enemy's Let's start the Last song's monsters! We can't knock them into the metro area. Stop them in their tracks! Teleportation ship down! The enemy means to attack the metro area. That's why they're holding some of their forces in reserve. We can't let that happen. Annihilate them! has dropped monsters. Stay alert! Yes, yes sir. sir! Here they come! Stay focused! Please, leave it to me next time. Incoming! Answer team, advance and draw the monster out. Infantry, we'll be your shield. is waiting. It takes guts.
the left. ships have begun attacking all teleportation ships are active shoot them down ships were going to attack the metro area. If we hadn't been alerted, we would have faced unimaginable losses. On the table should join us. We need a lot of fighters to protect the planet's crust. Let's fight together as allies. Your orders will be set real soon. EDF! I advise them to work on building up their forces as much as possible before the situation gets worse. We won! This victory is a major one! Operation success. We prevented an attack and saved countless lives. You did well. Raise up your voices in a battle cry for a band advance. MC getting into position. Don't stop! Keep moving! EMC nearing effective range. They're right there. Any closer, it would put us in harm's way. It just seems that way because they're so big. But they're still quite far away. Whoa! 
They're too damn big! The siren enters slumber when it loses strength. EMC can use their beams to put it to bed for a long time. Hold on! Intelligence. The head of Advanced Technologies Lab requests a halt to the operation. Confirming request. You know who, huh? Continue the operation. Very well. The EMC's simultaneous attacks will stop the siren in its tracks. Get ready. Get ready! Fire! Keep watch! Yes, yes sir! sir. One shot at this, so it has to hit. Make sure the target stays still.
Cameron has halted all activity. It's fallen over, but that thing's far from dead. We need that finishing blow. Surface units, we owe you a great debt for your service. Firing Buster Shock! Direct hit, confirmed! The target is up in flames! We got it! Phew! That's hot! The Buster's heat is scorching! What intense heat! It's like we're in an actual fire! The target is still moving! How is this possible? Surface unit, what's going on down there? Look! It's not dead! It's burning but still alive! This heat isn't from the buster, it's coming from the siren itself! The heat source is moving! Surface unit, what's happening? Is everything alright? The surrounding temperature is rising. It must be the siren's body temperature. The siren's skin is really hot. How can it move like this? A life form with a burning body. A seed straight out of hell. Recommence attack operations! That thing is a threat to humanity! We have to extinguish that flame! Monster! The siren is continually releasing its energy. If this continues... The siren changed its own body at the brink of death to survive. This puts an overbearing strain on its body, but this is its ultimate strategy for survival. So it can give up years of its life to escape death? Just how long does this thing have left? Nobody knows. It could be days, it could be years. We can't quite calculate its lifespan. And waiting for it to die naturally is not the best course of action for us. We need more data. Continue assault operations. Running. 
The siren has begun moving. That means it has suffered a wound grave enough to warrant this last-ditch behavior. That thing just changed its appearance. It must need time to rest. As do we. We should leave the chase to the Air Force. We already have fighter planes tracking the siren. Great. Then let's fall back. Ergonus and Archelus are terrifying creatures, but their sphere of activity is limited. They do not threaten the entire Earth. However, the siren is quick, burning everything in its path. It is a global menace. We should change its name from Siren to Glaucos. It's the highest level threat on this planet.